Hey guys, what's up? So today I'll be coming at you guys with an awesome card show here. Went over to the VW VFW Sports Card Show a week ago. That was pretty fun. We made it, guys. We made a long bike track there, but it was well worth it. Put on by Behind the Diamond. And when I walked in the show, saw these a huge display boxes here. Weren't priced out. Didn't actually end up picking up anything there, but there's some cool hockey in there. I saw was walking around looking at some tables, a lot of singles, a lot more modern than I thought. I thought it'd be some more vintage, but uh, that didn't bother me. Some packs there, was looking at a lot of wax. This table had a ton of great wax. Actually ended up picking up something from him, some older hockey boxers there that I saw. Actually ended up picking up a Topps hobby box there, which you guys will see. It was actually a two room show, which was kind of unique, which I liked about uh, the show. There's one table, which was kind of smaller, and then this table, this uh, room, which had a bunch of great tables in it, too. There was behind the diamonds box, and was walking around, saw some displays, a lot of Yankees there, and saw this awesome wax display. I believe it was put on by D'Angelo Sports. There was a really cool 2018 update hanger. How about an old 1718 select hobby box? You don't see those every day. You got Prism Retail. You got all the modern football, some black certified so pretty cool wax display there that was uh cool i would say so some retail wax which attracted me that playbook for 20 didn't actually end up picking up any of those and then we got some golf and fantasy sports you don't see those that often fantasy sports i know they always sell out then i went over to this table and saw alvin kamara auto and that really attracted me so I ended up actually picking up a lot of stuff at this table Really psyched about picking up that Alvin Kamara auto and a nice Dalvin Cook, which you guys will see in my recap. That was really awesome. Ended up working some more deals, as I said there, guys. Awesome table here. Got, had a bunch of great stuff and a bunch of great deals, which I'll talk about in my recap. And, yeah, went, also went up over to this guy. He had an Instagram, so forget his Instagram, but I was uh, talking to him for a little bit. And uh, went through this kind of bargain bin thing and didn't find any great deals in there. But there was a cool Greg Olson patch. Was actually rushing to look through some of this stuff because I only had a, about an hour until I had to leave. So still a fun show. Great timing uh, for me. And uh, yeah, it was an awesome show. There's behind the scene looks at Behind the Diamond. Picked up some more stuff. And I uh, was just walking around a little bit, seeing the vibe of the show. It started to pack up when I left. I believe that was at like 11. And uh, some pretty loaded display cases there, as you see. And then you got some uh, lower end displays. Some, some nice football there at that table. Got a bunch of other stuff. Some baseball, some basketball. Bunch of uh, modern stuff mainly in the show. So that was really cool to see was walking around as you see it got a little bit tight there's the table i picked up a bunch of stuff at and uh yeah it was, it was overall a really fun show uh hope you guys did enjoy this quick little vlog didn't actually end up picking up that much footage because i had to go early but that was kind of unfortunate uh but still a really fun show ended up picking up a lot of great stuff picked up uh that alvin kamara auto which you guys saw so stay tuned for the recap that was really awesome a fun show vfw show if you guys can make it out Definitely would recommend to bunch of modern stuff here that kind of attracted me. Didn't actually end up closing the deal on any of those. Uh, some certified autos, some cool stuff. I like I like a lot of the modern RPAs usually. So that was pretty much it, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed that VFW show. That's me leaving the show early, which was kind of unfortunate, but hope you guys enjoyed it. That was an awesome card show vlog, and uh, yeah, what what a show there. A smaller show too, forty five tables. But it was still a great show. Had an awesome time there. Got some awesome deals. So stay tuned for the recap to come. Have it all filmed out. And uh, yeah, it's a pretty long video. But see you guys later. That's why I didn't add it on. But uh, see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed that vlog.